Bill and Hillary Clinton just released their 2015 tax returns, and they present what I would call a teachable moment. In 2015, the Clintons wrote off $1,042,000 in charitable contributions. Of that, $1 million went to none other than the Clinton Family Foundation, where they get to control the flow of the money. So in 2015, 96% of the Clintons' charity went to themselves. The rest of their charitable donations from that year went to an establishment named the Desert Classic Charities. That same year, that same charity made a $700,000 donation back to the Clintons. So the Clintons donated to it, and then it donated to the Clintons, and what did they both get for it? Tax deductions. And more importantly, control of where all that money flowed. The year before, in 2014, the Clintons donated $3 million to their foundation. After themselves, the charity that received the most of the Clintons' charity was the Diplomacy Center Foundation, a charity whose board includes Henry Kissinger, Condoleezza Rice, Madeleine Albright, James Baker, Colin Powell, and, oh yeah, Hillary Clinton. So in 2014, the Clintons got a huge tax deduction for donating to themselves again, and they and their friends kept control of the millions. So that's how money flows from the Clintons back to themselves and their friends. To complete the circle, let's look at how the money flows to the Clintons. Since 2001, the Clintons have made more than $150 million from giving speeches at huge establishments. Big banks alone have paid them more than 39 times to give private speeches. So the money flows to the Clintons from schmoozy events like dinners and whatnot, where they show up and say a few words. That's what they do to get hundreds of millions of dollars. And then they turn around and take that money and donate it to themselves or their friends, where they can then recirculate that money however they want. So what we learn from the teachable moment of the Clintons' tax returns is how the 1% creates a complete circle of money flowing tightly amongst themselves, with the Clintons in control at the wheel. And it's all in the name of charity. Tonight, let's talk about that.